love me two times by the doors. I'm going to try and explain this a little bit here to you as to what's going on the beginning part, even though it does change a little bit on the, uh, I believe it's the second verse. So, if you make an E minor chord shape, you can play off these notes. And all that action right now is happening between the fifth and the fourth string. So you're fretting on the second fret of the fifth string, and then it's open on the fourth. So it's back and forth between the fifth and the fourth. E twice and trill on the first fret of the third string. So you go. seven. If you can reach out your pinky to the fifth fret of the first string, hit the second string, your fingers are already in position on the second fret, then to the third fret of the first string. Um, and that's not probably actually where you play it, but it it sounds good still, and I want to keep it in that first position there. So here's what you got from the beginning. Seven. C7, seven. G, D, C7, seven, B7, seven. and every once in a while you hear that, or you're just going to hit the E minor. On the second verse, it sounds like there's a delay on the trill, the second trill. So it sounds like this. And other than that, it's pretty much the chords throughout the whole song that I've just gone over. Um, so you got to really listen to that song for the changes. <laughs> 